Now I know that this isn't news to some of you, and still, we cannot ignore Amazon Italy releasing their pricing for the new AMD Ryzen 3000 series XT processors. According to some very official Reddit sources, AMD is set to announce their new Zen 2 refresh chips tomorrow for a potential release date of July 7th. Word is that AMD will release three 3000 series parts, only two of which have been specified, the Ryzen 9 3900 XT and Ryzen 5 3600 XT, both of which are regularly on Amazon's bestseller list. Online blogs have assumed that the supposed Ryzen 7 3800 XT will complete this collection. Also on our release radar is PS5 and skepticism surrounding PSVR compatibility. We've heard that PS5 is compatible with new HD cameras, but gamers are still left in the dark regarding franchise favorites like Resident Evil Village, Resident Evil 8, which has yet to be released. In the land of the living, VR headsets produced by Vario are currently being used by Boeing to train the astronauts of the 2021 Starliner mission. This equipment is helping astronauts learn how to properly land at the International Space Station. These headsets are practical for virtual training sessions because they utilize retinal resolution technology that adjusts to details only within the bounds of natural human vision. This is the first time that VR has been used for aerospace training. NASA has dabbled in the past with VR as a complementary tool, but it isn't until now that VR has really taken off in this industry. Is that too punny? Meanwhile, SpaceX has casually moved on to its third rocket launch in two weeks. Last Saturday, the 13th, during a Florida sunrise, a Falcon 9 successfully launched with its precious cargo of Skysats and Starlink satellites into orbit. It still seems like only yesterday that the Falcon 9 launched the Crew Dragon for NASA. Before June is over, it is possible that SpaceX will complete two more launches, including another Starlink flight, as well as a GPS satellite for the US Space Force. Fun fact, not that all of these weren't fun already. But according to the MIT Tech Review, astronomers have found another Earth-like planet that revolves around a sun-like star. Its name needs a bit of work, but planet KOI-456.04 has given astronomers extra energy to search for more habitable planets. Sorry if I got the name wrong. Maybe I'll call Elon for some pronunciation suggestions. That was a news heavy week, so take a minute to let that all sink in. I don't know about you guys, and I'm feeling a space movie tonight. Or all week. I'd love to hear your favorite space movies, so comment below and don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button so you can find us each week. You can also find us on Instagram and Facebook, and don't be shy. Check out our website, links are all below. One last thing. Code Red is a segment and dashboard where we announce contests and reveal winners. So stay tuned next Monday where we announce a contest you don't want to miss. My name's Jana, this is Dashboard, and we'll see you there.